Do what? Tambourine, the tambourine, tambourine. Say that five times fast? No. <laughs> oh, why not? Oh, okay. It'll just make it bigger for water or something I already did. Right, man. Code red, code red. Thanks for the screen. guys with cameras, code red. Code red, yeah. Oh, she picked up the phone. Oh no. She called in one, one, one. Oh yeah, smell that. Unburnt fuel. <laughs> Good old fashioned car right there. I think we should uh, rename this bank company Hurtington instead of Huntington. Because they're almost always butthurt. I wonder if they have a drive through around back. <laughs> he looked up me and then he grinned. <laughs> Oh wow, 
Oh, so this theater has been here since 1935. In 1943, a fire destroyed the building, but it was rebuilt and opened back up by 1945. Yeah. Cool. Poor house. Dill pickle chowder. That's not good. Sounds interesting. I don't know about good, but interesting. Yeah, interesting to me. See any customers, do you? Oh yeah, there, there's a group over there. Yeah. Picking up the phone. Dial in wine one one. Oh, he put it back down, I think. Oh, the other dude's calling? Oh, okay. Oh, yep, yep. There he is. He's on the phone with wine one one while he plays with his fries. over the phone. Oh, I think he 
got educated over the phone. He looks pissed now. He got educated over the phone, I think. He's in there shaking his head. <laughs> I think he got educated over the phone. That place is closed. There's not a single light on in there. I'll never understand why people come up to you and ask, what are you doing? I mean, it's, it's so obvious, you know? Yeah. Huh? Recording? So how long has this hardware store been here? My family's owned it since 2004, but uh, the previous owners started, worked at Coast to Coast in, I think, 81. Okay. But it's been a continuous hardware store or big grocery store since... Oh, you can leave it up there. I'll zoom in on it. <laughs> Sorry. What are you all doing? We're just touring the town. Yeah. Did you go into Easy Street? So no. Oh, if you're gonna have dinner, that's a really good. They place. came out and yelled at us for recording through the window. Oh. They called the police on yeah. us for recording. Where's this gonna be? At? On YouTube. Oh. Yeah. So the have whole you? world will see it. Oh, good. Because well, I have. Let's see. I have subscribers in Denmark, in in really? Germany, in Aus Austria, Australia. <laughs> Where are you? I'm out by, out by Lansing. Oh, so you're a local Michigan yeah. person. So you need to come back in the summertime. Okay. Because beautiful, yep. beautiful oh, landscape. So the, 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 it's a five-year warranty on them. Yep. What is this? Yep. Everywhere. Okay. Yep. The fruit trees. Uh, cool. This is a fruit belt. Thank you. You're all welcome. along Lake Michigan. Right. Um, there's a beautiful fruit stand that opens mid-June, yeah, right. jolly right. Right. Do you go to Holland every year? I do. <laughs> I kind of oh, figured. Great. The way you were talking okay. about the blossoms, I kind of figured. Oh, and Say so eight time, more. Four more yeah. Yeah. Bad, so. Another good place to go is the I'm ready to put the third the okay. right yeah. by McDonald's. Okay. It's a m hundreds of booths of fine antiques. Oh, okay. Or Collectibles. There's an antique mall like that out, uh, Howell, off of Burkhart Road, yeah. right by the outlet mall. Yes, Howell. Like, right next door. My used to live there. I used to live there. Um, <laughs> the Enchanted Beach, she's not open today, but that's an, an excellent little gym. Okay. A uh, bead store, so fun stuff. You ever go up to Traverse City? Yeah, it was just there in the tour. You cool. go up there during the Cherry Festival, though? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, you got to go I, up there. Um, <laughs> Not into town, go up into the, the little uh, finger yeah. where all the cherry trees are. Oh, it's Beautiful. awesome. I have done that uh, not during the cherry festival, but just before. Right. And it always just amazes me that they have 12 foot fences to keep the deer. Yep. Because their deer are even bigger than our deer. Mm. So. That's pretty impressive. It is. It's hardcore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but beautiful. It is. Yep. Well, you and have a wonderful day, ma'am. You too. Yeah. There's wineries. You need to come back. There's okay. multiple wineries. Wineries. Oh, I'm going to have to bring my woman back. She and loves the wine. <laughs> lovely places. Lovely right. Places. So. She likes going up to Traverse City and getting that cherry wine. 
Ooh, who doesn't? <laughs> you know, cherries, there is a place, it's not open for the public, it's just true business, uh -huh. but uh, Bainbridge Beverage, and they manufacture cherry juice and cherry syrup for the use in bars. Okay. And cherry juice for use in like arthritis people take pure cherry juice. Huh. But they're and they're affiliated with the Jolly Orchards. But okay. there's actually an awful lot going on. You should look at Water Belief Fruit Exchange. That's we, an, we were just over there. That's an old time excellent example of good old-fashioned Michigan. Uh, have you ever been to Eastern Market? The where? Eastern Market in Detroit? No. Uh, Is that a, like, a fruit exchange market? Uh, well, fruits, vegetables, meats. Oh, it's a really? huge outdoor market on Saturdays. It's awesome. I mean, it's blocks long. Oh, my gosh. That's You'll like love that it. Happens. they got fresh flowers, both yeah. cut and potted. I mean... And there's all kinds of awesome places to eat right around it, too. So, Louisiana, 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 Louisiana Creole Gumbo. Yeah. That place is for Louisiana. They have the best red beans and rice at that place. Oh. The cornbread is tobacco, too. Oh, yeah. And so is yeah. their, uh, their, uh, uh, the, well, I can't think of the name of it. Jambalaya, yes. Yeah, I'm a fan of that because I'm almost done. Okay. They do an awesome job at it. So if you ever want to go for a road trip on a Saturday morning, because the best time to do it is like be there at like 7 in the morning. Well, they open at like 5. That's early. But I mean, the place is by so by seven thirty. It's packed. It. So <laughs> sometimes I'll wake up at four just to go down there. Yeah. So you live by Lansing. I have a brother that lives in Stockbridge. Okay. So yeah. I got friends in Stockbridge. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right. You have well, a wonderful day. <laughs> you too. Yep. Bye bye. You too, thank you. Okay, almost everybody in this town is awesome, but Easy Street over there got bent. Yeah, it's weird. Everybody else is just all happy and casual and cordial. Of course, we're not done yet, but we're more than, more than halfway done. <laughs> 